I'm not going to let you go before we talk books. Um, you, and you really sound like a man who reads. Yeah. What books, Ralph, have you read? Three books at least that have been life changing to you? Yeah, I love books. Uh, my wife complains I'm buying them, not reading them <laughs> lately. I tell her I'm reading board packs as a substitute, <laughs> but my library gets built. Um, yeah, I, I, I read very widely. Mm. Um, um, right now, I'm reading the English version of the Quran mm -hmm. to my mother, Shagrin, because she says, you know, the only way to God is through Christ. So I'm having a bit of a discussion with my mother around that. Um, but the books that I think uh, were life changing, um, and I read them at different. One is not really a book, but mm -hmm. I, I think it can have some lessons, you know, to some people listening in on, on this. Um, um, Lord of the Flies, I read it in, as part of my O-level uh, literature book. Right. I still love that uh, William Golding's book around the British boys stranded on island, dealing with issues of self-governance. And uh, I mean, what comes out of there is just the fine line between good and bad. Mm. We often think of people as, you know, inherently bad. But the line is really mm. thin, groupthink. Um, and it awakened in me this thing about, um, you know, don't judge too harshly. Yeah. Because that line is very thin between good and bad. Um, so um, Lord of the Flies, you know, it is a, a, a book that, um, you know, it, it, it awakened in me this point about the thin line. Mm. Um, Four Agreements, um, I read it in the early 2000s. Um, I was, I think, just about point out just before I met my wife. Um, so it must be close on to 20 years ago. Um, and I, I, I try and live by those four agreements. Mm. You're asking me um, earlier about the four, um, I mean, the, the habits. Mm, mm. Um, you know, um, so I try and practice those four agreements. Um, um, the one of those four agreements, which I often say to people is, uh, sometimes it's not about you. When situations happen, um, and people do things, it's actually not about you, it's yeah. about them. Yeah. And, and it's very important to learn. So that, that um, four agreements is, then there's an A to Z um, of affluence, um, Deepak Chopra. So I, it's not really a book, but okay. it's, a, it's a 30 minute podcast. And he goes through the A to Z of affluence. And affluence is not about money, mm. but he talks about affluence as, um, as an example, the lack of worry. Okay. And, uh, and in D, he has the word Dharma. Mm. Uh, and Dharma means everybody has a purpose. Mm. There's no human being on this earth who, who has doesn't no have a purpose. purpose. Mm. Find your purpose, you act it, you'll be successful, you'll have affluence. Mm. So, so those, um, the four agreements and the A to Z, I listen to it at least three or four times a year. Wow. I just go back and quickly check. What, am I, what, what, what can I learn now, which I didn't wow. learn then. Wow, what, what an... Awesome. Um, uh, this this has been this has been a business class, um, master class rather. This has been a master class. Ralph, thank you so much for appreciate the time. The time. Yeah, appreciate uh, the time. Jumping off a plane from Tehran and coming into the studio. So thank appreciate. you so much. No, thank we you. We shall sir. shake hands. I think it's a bit health uh, uh, safe to do that.